All right, welcome back to the fifth and final episode of Modded Dark Souls. If you haven't seen the series yet, all the items are randomized, all the enemies are randomized, all the fog walls are randomized, key items are not randomized, and then there's just like some silly non-gameplay related mods. In the last episode, I found the Lord Vessel, and I have three of the souls needed for it, so I only need one more Lord Soul, and I have no idea where it is. But once I get that, I can open the store and fight the final boss. Today, you might be able to tell by the fit, but I'm back in the OG fit. The very same fit I started. And today, the big rock, boom. The big rock is gone. No more big rock. Havel's ring is coming off. And yes, that means... Wait a minute. Oh, I'm light rolling. That's awkward. I was going to say that means I'm medium rolling. But wait, there's more. Today, the weapon that I will be slaying the final boss with is none other than the Scimitar Plus 5. The very first weapon I ever got. First, I actually do need to go upgrade it, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, I guess let's just go, there's what no time to waste. Go on. I'm kinda sad that I'm, like, not medium rolling today. I honestly thought I would be medium rolling. Maybe I should just, like, uh... I'm not gonna use it, I'm just gonna keep it on me. That way we get those fucking medium rolls. <laughs> it wouldn't be a Snell and Dark Souls finale without medium rolls. The only way I can upgrade this further is if I make it divine. And I I don't I don't have green titanite shards. I have like shit all green titanite shards. That's a problem. But you know what? Let's just roll with the scimitar we have now and if I have to upgrade it later, I'll upgrade it later. At the very end of the last episode, all the golden walls disappeared, which means every area that has a golden wall, I can now go through it. The question is, which golden wall do I go to first? I think the first uh, golden wall I head to is the most obvious one, which would be the Duke's Archives. Hey, whoa, oh shit, I forgot this, this bitch is crazy now. Sorry I killed your fucking boyfriend, God. Anyway, let's forget about her. Oh god, she's coming. Oh god, she has like a mega weapon. Okay, we have to sprint to the Duke's archives. Go, go, quick, before she catches up. See, this golden wall which previously blocked me is now gone. Um, um, um. Yui! Holy shit. Oh no, dude, I'm gonna die. I'm so fucked. If only I had light rolls. Alright, out the way. Out the way, bird boy. Okay, that's actually not horrible damage. If the damage off of this bad boy stays that consistent, then I'm not too worried. For all I know, this boss could take me directly where I need to go, and that, that'd just be it. That'd be the entire series. This video would be like eight minutes long. <laughs> that'd be embarrassing. For all I know, this video is like fucking 30 minutes long. Here I go. I gotta go quick. Where will this take us? Oh, the moonlight. Oh! Oh my god! Whoa! Dude! I do no damage. I do literally none. This isn't gonna work. I can't beat this boss with that much damage. Alright, I have to use the OP weapon for this fight. I have no hope that I win this fight, actually. Can I stun him? Holy shit. Oh, come on! I just have to live a little longer. <gasps> oh no, dude. One more hit. <laughs> I need to find out if embers count as part of the key item pool because I feel like they might, but they also might not. If I'm gonna upgrade my regular weapon, then I'm gonna have to get the the ember that's in the depths. I guess I'm about to find out whether embers are randomized or not. Oh, my game crashed. Okay, are embers key items? No. Okay, embers are key items. Wait, I said no, but then I said they were. Embers are key items, which means I'm safe. Thank fuck embers count as key items, because uh, I wouldn't have been able to upgrade the scimitar then. Do I make it raw for the memes? Oops. <laughs> Whoops. How did our scimitar become a raw scimitar plus one? What the fuck? How on earth did that happen? 
Oh, I say someone's been tampering with our raw scimitar. I do no damage to anyone, bro. This weapon really isn't gonna cut it. The, she just parried me. Did you hear that? The fucking vine boon parry. I never thought I'd hear that again. Holy shit. She's fun with the goddamn lightsaber. This Big rock. Must, must win Lin is dead. You know, I said I was going to use the scimitar this episode, but the big rock is starting to look real. Real nice and big. And strong. Hello, mate. Just coming through. Just coming through, mate. Just coming through. Thanks. No matter what, I absolutely will beat the final boss with the scimitar, even if it takes me days. Days of grinding, I tell you. Days. Here we go. Ornstein. Why is he red? I didn't realize that the fucking skin I had on him made him red. Unless that's some other shenanigans going on. Overpower him. Fucking grand slam him. At least you guys finally- Oh my fucking god, I'm dead. Drink. Death. Okay, there we go. A copper coin, yeah. <laughs> He's carrying one coin on him. The whole, I'm gonna use the scimitar this episode thing is really not working out too well, huh? Whoa, shit, where the fuck am I? I don't know where I am, but I didn't even know this place existed, I don't think. Well, that is... No, wait, there's more. Ah! Okay, well, there's a fog wall here. I don't know where the fuck this will take me. Oh, yes! Oh, this is the boss we need to fight! This is it! Dude, this is the boss! Oh no, I do no damage. This is the boss! This is the Seath boss! That's it! That's it! Holy shit. Holy shit. I will beat this boss with the scimitar. That's a promise. Look how little damage I do, dude. Oh, dude, no way. What are the odds that I find that so quick? I thought this would take forever. I actually had like a notepad with like shit written down on it. Like of where to go and like what to do. But looks like I won't be needing it. Here I am in Seath's fucking boss room. I need to activate my gamer mode. I want it. I need it. My precious. Oh shit. I just took my first hit. <laughs> Half health, by the way. <laughs> hey guys, it's me, Snelly. Half health, by the way. Just took my first hit. Dude, raw scimitar plus two is OP. Who would have guessed? Oh, brother. He's swinging that thing. I don't like that. Watch where you swing that thing. Today is the day I win. Your explosions mean nothing to me. By this point, I've become so powerful, so fucking deluded, that your explosions literally feel like nothing to me. The only thing I see is red. Well, actually, right now it would be more, the only thing I see is blue, but metaphorically speaking, the only thing I see is red. The red of my enemies and the red on my toilet paper. Here it is, ladies and gentlemen, the final Lord Soul, just like that. The thing is, the final boss will probably be an absolute grind. You're probably giggling to yourself because I'm like, oh my god, dude, not even an hour in, I've already got to the final boss. Meanwhile, you're sitting there like, oh my god, this guy doesn't know how long the video is. Here I stand at the final door. It's about time. Offer souls to the Lord Vessel. Here I am, with only a scimitar 
in my hand in a dream. I march forward. I'm just gonna run past all these guys. <laughs> my final tough opponent. This worm guy. I win. Here we go. The funny thing is, I genuinely do not know if this will just let me through the fog wall or if it's going to send me somewhere else. For all I know, I just grinded all that and the final boss is just behind some random ass fog wall. Here I come. The final boss. Ha! <laughs> no fucking way. I just fought you. But this one's gonna be even harder. Holy shit. Oh fuck. He got me good. Oh my god. I might actually die. Holy shit. He's beating my ass. Ho! Oh. Gwyn. Am I really just gonna let him win like that? No. This is my anime protagonist moment. I'm going to run in there. And with the power of friendship, I'm gonna beat his fucking teeth in. Here I go. The final boss. A British person. Well, at least our schools aren't shooting ranges. He says as he fucking tries to kill me. Dude, I'm not even American. The memories. Smo and the centipede demon. The bed of Seath. Gwyn. The very first boss I beat in this series. And now, my final opponent, Guy Fieri. Oh shit, he's gonna kill me again. Drink a Sunny D. It might be the last time you ever drink one. Oh god. Oh! Slice his ass in half. Do it again. Finally. At long last. Cursed modded Dark Souls comes to an end. Before I say goodbye to the series forever. One last long swig of Sunny D. Oh yeah. The kidneys are fucking loving this. Oh, and there we go. And finally, I think it's only appropriate for me to do one last thing. Bow down for Snellid, your dark lord. My lord, bless thy safe return. Let Kath and Frampt serve your highness. We are here to serve your highness. Let true dark be cast upon the world. Our Lord hath returned. Alright, <laughs> before I say goodbye, there are a few things that I would like to say. 
and that first and foremost thank you to all the goddamn uh talented people that made all these mods the sunny d mods my favorite i think definitely but uh wow yeah thank you to everyone who made the mods secondly thank you to everyone who has uh watched this series uh when i when i i think when i recorded the first episode i had like 20 something subscribers 30 something subscribers and now i've got like 2.3 thousand subscribers which is just that's that's dumb <laughs> uh that's silly i i should not have that many subscribers but uh, <laughs> uh yeah seriously thank you to everyone who's liked watched commented subscribe literally anything thank you uh one last thing before i go i guess i want to talk about the future of dark souls on the snellid channel what 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 is next what is he gonna do next and the answer is um yeah there's tons of souls content that i'm gonna be making i don't really consider myself a souls youtuber or whatever i kind of just enjoy playing games that i like and uh dark souls just uh, happens to be a game like that i like that being said my next adventure into dark souls on this channel will not be modded my current plan is to do just a regular playthrough of Dark Souls 3. There's still a lot I haven't seen in that game. Yeah, I'd rather experience it normally, uh, fully, at least once before I jump into the deep end with mods. So, so thank you, everyone. And I'll see you in whenever and whatever game I'm playing. Might, might be Dark Souls 3 next video. Might not be. Might be something else. I don't know. I'll see you then.